guys and welcome back to my channel today we are going to do an update for my whole collection project pan and i'm doing this with a bunch of lovely ladies and sarah and emily they joined us all together this year i did it for the whole 2019 as well as as they did but we didn't do it as a collab so i'm really excited for this year that we are doing it together and this is update five i believe for this second round i have an empty for this update and i'm pretty excited to roll in a new product i have some not so great progress on the other items but well that's one that is pretty exciting yeah i have a lot of lip products in this project and i'm just really excited for the refresh next update and there will be some changes to the project for sure so i hope you guys are excited for this update just as i am and let's just get into my empty my empty for this update is my loose face powder from w7 it is the flawless face loose color correcting mineral powder this one right here it was the one with all the colors and this bulky packaging and i'm really excited to call this done it was so close last update and when i didn't want to tap it into the lid anymore i found that i could remove this sticker with which meant that i could access the product inside the things because it doesn't come with a shifter that i can like pull out mixed it all up into a zipper container and it's done i'm pretty excited about that so i'm going to roll in a new item for this one i think we are going kind of in order and then we are taking all the lip products in the end i think that is the best way to do it i hope that is okay with you well in the all of that i did it in the intro i have my blush in El Charo, it is the W7 Matte Me Blush Cheeky Matte Powder Blush. This one right here, it is in darker color, so I'm not really using it at the moment. I I have used it. I can see the kick up um, from last time I used it. I used it l last week, I think. It's Tuesday today, yeah. Last week, I think I used it um, once, so maybe I have used it maximum of five times this month which is not good enough at all to pen because that was my goal in january but yeah this is one of the products that is going to be rolled out next month because this is not a summer shade and i really want to work on another blush uh, and not this color at least yeah i hope you can see some difference in the progress but because it has somewhere in the middle but and then that, not really. <laughs> a product that I haven't used for quite a while in this project is my W7 Petal to the Metal Duochrome Liquid Liner. I will say that I have been really good at using it for the last month. It's, it's not that I'm using it every single day at all. I have used it like three times and that is really good because I have in total like used it five times or maybe six seven times if i'm really really good uh, in this project overall since uh, so this might be rolled out but it is a really nice color for the summertime so maybe i'm going to have it in but i'm not going to finish this anytime soon i don't really feel like using a liquid gold liner every single day i just don't it is yeah stay me golden is the color and you can't see any progress because I have only used it like three times this month. Okay, this is something that I need to explain a little bit. <laughs> this is my eyeshadow palette called Paulina from Blush Tribe. And yes, there is some really nice progress in this, but not really at the same time. If you saw my Panda palette update, you would know. I'm panning the shade called Friends in this project. And as you can see, it has pan. But... It's kind of a cheat pan because I dug it out. <laughs> I had a really nice dip as you can see in the picture from last time. Um, so I was really close anyway, but I wanted to do a shimmery green color for my panda palette. And that is now a Franken shadow where I have mixed friends and then this shadow right here um together with some other shades that you can see in this picture and i really like that shade i haven't used it on my eyes yet because i just made it yesterday <laughs> and today i'm obviously wearing something that matches 
this shirt. This is going to be rolled out next time because I'm not going to finish that fringe shadow anytime soon, so I can hit pan because it's not really counting as an empty yet. So I'm just going to roll it out in the refresh and I think I'm going to be fine then. <laughs> this one is quite exciting. This is my foundation from Women London. It is called the Lasting Finish 25 Hour Nude in Ivory. This one right here. I rolled it in like two updates ago, I think. I was up here when I rolled it in, then I was down to here, last update, and now I'm all the way down to here. That is so exciting. I'm so excited about it. I was not expecting for this to go this fast or me just using it so much. I'm really excited because that means I can finish this by next update. Um, that would be perfect because of the refresh, you know, um, and a non cruelty free item out of my collection at the same time, plus a foundation, which is really nice. Um, but yes, I, it was brand new when I rolled it into the project. So to use that much in a month, that is quite good. And I have not been overdoing it. I have just been using foundation five days a week, basically. Um, last week I did take a break though, so. Then we have my Honolulu bronzer from W7. Um, I have not seen that amazing progress, but I have used it quite a bit, I think. Um, if you think about, I'm paying another Franken bronzer in uh, my 2020 um, project pan. So this is uh, it's quite good use. I have gotten out of it. You can't see any visible, I think, but I have used it a handful of times. The focus bronzer is my Franken bronzer, so this is not really a priority, but I ch when we went away for a weekend, I chose to take this blush, no, bronzer with me instead of the one, the other one, because this is not as fragile as the other one. Um, but I can see some wear in the pan, or on the product, but I don't know if you can see anything in the pictures. I think that is everything, and now we can go on to the lipsticks and the brow crayon thing. So let's just take the brow thing. This is the W7 Brow Sweep Grooming Crayon. I haven't been focusing on this at all for this month, so I have the tiniest amount of progress in, on it. But that is only because I am panning a brow pencil in my drop chin before summer that I really want to focus on before it ends in like a few, few weeks. And this is definitely staying in the project even though we are going to do the refresh next month. This is everything that I have left in it, and if you see my progress, you can see why I want to have it in still. And I do think it will have some progress by next update anyway, because again, drop in before st summer ends on the 21st of June, I think. That is the progress. Tiniest amount of progress right there. Okay, these two I don't have any progress on, even though I have used them once or twice. But if you know about panning lipsticks, you need to use them more than two times to make progress. It is two shades from the Metallic Mattes line. SOS is the brown one and Apollo is the orange one. You have seen me wearing this orange one in a few videos and you guys liked it. I did too. But there's no progress on it at all. There's so much product in these tubes, but no progress. Then we have my MAC Brave lipstick and I have used this and I was really excited to see the progress because I actually didn't know how much I have used it and if I was supposed to or could see any progress I should say. This is how much I have left on it but I was really surprised because I'm not focusing on this lipstick at, a mo at the moment. The one that I'm kind of focusing on doesn't have any progress in another project pen so that is it's a, but yes, this is the progress from there to there in the month. That is quite good if you haven't focused on the lipstick. But again, it is my kind of top touch up lipstick and it lives in my bag at work. But I do have quite a few lipsticks uh, in that bag. So that is quite good that I have reached for this that much. It is time for my roll-in, I think. I don't have any more to talk about. Nope. I have updated my spreadsheet and I have pulled out the things that I finished and stuff like that. So let's just go through 
the list. I have in total from my spreadsheet 285 makeup products that I have in my collection at the moment. If you have seen my videos before, I don't remove the ones that I have in a project at the moment. So, so if I get one of those items, I can't. I, I don't roll it into this one. So one, two, two, eight, five. Two, seven, three. I think that is a lipstick. Queen of Hearts. Is that a, is that a red lipstick? I think it is. Um, nope. <laughs> okay, let's shorten it and take all the lip products out, but not the lip liners and the lip balms because I don't have any of those in a project. Oh, well, I have a lip liner, but that is done in this week. So, so let's take one to one hundred and ninety-five. Then you can count how many lipsticks and lip scrubs I have in my collection. Seventy-eight. About that blush I wanted to work on. <laughs> this is Benefit Rugature Blush. I think that is okay for the summertime. No matter what, not use the other one that much. So, yeah, let's take Rugature because we can. And I want to. I love that color. So, let me go get that one and I will be right back. So this is uh, a deluxe size sample, or oh, size just, uh, <laughs> of the Benefit Rogature. And I have departed this from a holiday palette. So it is kind of old, but this is the color, if you don't know. I'm pretty sure you know, because it's quite known. Um, but yes, there's some um, imprint, but I have kind of worn it down a little bit. So I'm really excited. I have a goal to a pen, I think. I don't know if I can finish it in six months. And I, I am pregnant with a baby in October. So my goal is to hit pen on this this year. And that is my new product. Pretty exciting. I know I have two blushes, but I think that is the maximum I, I want to have in this project. And then I need to set some new goals for myself and how many products I want to have in each for next update. I have been here forever. I'm so sorry, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you haven't already, check out the other ladies down below. They are amazing, and they are doing amazing, for that matter. Um, so I hope you want to stick around if you're new here. I do a lot of product plans, and let me know if you have any video ideas or anything like that. And then just until my next video, please take care. <laughs> Bye. Thank you.